da 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 a podcast. Badger shame. Right, the fifth one. Yeah. This one sounds fucking ridiculous. Smoking Smarties. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Smarties, yeah. I think <laughs> actually like talking about like little sweets with the... Who, who are these people? I mean... They're the parent society. They are no, no, the, no, no, no. the voice of reason for parents <laughs> all around the world. <laughs> like, who are these people smoking it? I mean, who's going to be like, oh, I got an idea to that, boys. Let's, let's go to the park, like, and let's get some fucking Smarties. Smarties, oh. Smarties in a split. And we'll do like, the M&Ms. Oh, oh, don't, skills. oh watch out Taste the M&Ms. rainbow. <laughs> It's <laughs> 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 also fueled by internet tutorials. Oh, for God's sake! Fucking kill the internet. It's killing, <laughs> it's killing the kids. Smoking oh. Smarties involves crushing the candy until it is in powder form. Once fully dissolved, which is pointless, it's fully dissolved is in like water in it. Like you put it in water, like sugar devol- dissolves in yeah, tea. Yeah. Wait, wait a minute, so, what, what are they putting in? I don't know. Well, even if it's wrong, I mean, if it's in powder form and then dissolve it, then it's completely gone. But then it's apparently an opening is made in the on the side of a package by like puffing the sugar powder, inhaling it like cigarette smoke. Wait, if it's dissolved, it's gone. Wait, How can you inhale it if it's not there? What are they dissolving it in? I don't get this. No, I don't know. I don't think they. I think they've got this wrong. Yeah. Completely, <laughs> they haven't dissolved anything. It's still there. It's like once it is prepared, then it is. You know. What's the wait, 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 I'm completely confused. But do they crush it up and then smoke it? They is crush it? it up and then they smoke it. Oh, so, so, but it says once fully dissolved, an opening is made inside the package. What package? Yeah, Which that, package? Some, like that smart east tube, or maybe it's a smart east tube. Maybe they use that. It's like a pipe. Uh, but dissolve it in what? I don't get what it... Like, in air? I don't know. You, uh, yeah. <laughs> this is you're puffing on the sugar powder next time you like cigarette smoke. Inhaling the sugar powder from the Smarties candies can cause infection, chronic coughing, and even choking. Well, what, why? Why would you do that? Why don't you just go out and smoke instead? Yeah, if you're <laughs> healthier to have a fag. <laughs> That's fucking... I never, I never hear that one, though. Yeah. Uh, that must... I think it's just stupid. Like, what do you get? Like, you just wasted a pack of Smarties, basically. Yeah. <laughs> you just wasted a good pack of Smarties and... That. Yeah, you're not going to get anything from that. There's no benefits, you know. Just... No, well... Yeah. Well, the sixth one is pretty incredible. We can't do this. Right. Like, you and me both. Not because I'm a vegetarian or any shit, or because oh, right, yeah. we have hair or anything like that. <laughs> ne- well, actually, we could... No, I lie. I lie. We could do this one. Oh, right, okay, okay. But you, you, can we do as, it right as, now? As straight <laughs> heterosexual males, I don't oh, think... Oh, right, okay, okay, I get what you Can mean. you guess which one it is? Uh, I, I, I don't know what it is, but... Right, well... I'm the, assuming it's something to do with homosexuals. No, no, it's what? not. It's, 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 not. it's uh, women and homosexuals. It's what? tampon drunkenness. Right. <laughs> I'll read the description. This tampon is soaked in alcohol and then inserted into a girl's vagina or boy's rectum. I suppose with a girl, you could switch between the rectum and the vagina at will. <laughs> or maybe do a double ender. Just yeah, put it both d- in. D- double it, man. Double it up, yeah. The alcohol is soaked up by the vagina walls, creating the feeling of being intoxicated without sipping alcohol directly. Right, so your vagina will smell like shit. Yeah. Your no, vagina no. will smell like a dirty Russian, <laughs> Besides the obvious risks to those private bodily parts, the tampon can soak up a sh- about a shot of alcohol, increasing the risk of alcohol poisoning. Not too honest, a shot is not that much. Yeah. In in regards. But it bypasses your liver and your kidneys. Oh, that's true. So it goes directly into your bloodstream. Yeah, mm. but it's it's like the guy who um uh, got his wife to pour like a load of uh, I don't know what the fuck it was. It was just a load of spirits into Spirit. his ass, and he just died. Oh, so that doesn't yeah. sound like a good story to tell. No, I'm just, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just saying. Like it explains like how strong it must be. Yeah, because yeah. well, the first time I ever saw like the coming back to the vodka eyeballs. Um, what what's the thing? Something friend Perry Golage night pizza. Something you know, the two like one of them was a girl. One of them was like an old guy pretending to be like a teenager, and what? he's like, "I hate you all, man." Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, and they went to my beats, and they think they're like big I DJs. Sorry. I, I sorry. What what do you how do you pronounce it? I pizza. <laughs> I beat her. I, I, I beat her. Sorry, I'm back to the point in hand. We got that. Right. What are you saying? What are you saying? Well, that's that's the I saw that drunk the eyeballing with the vodka. That's oh what I saw right, first, right. So. Yeah, yeah. I suppose it's just exactly the same. It's just a different body part. People will be doing up the nose soon. Maybe we'll snorting yeah. vodka. It's drowning. Yeah. <laughs> or, what they, or what they could do, you know, just out of the ordinary, they could actually try and drink it. Mm, uh, yeah, no. yeah. Be a bit, that's a bit rebellious, though, really. Yeah. 
yeah, I think breaking the taboo there. That's a bit yeah. too hardcore. Um, I, I I know a guy who. Oh, you know a guy who's done um, ass in the eye. Ass uh, in the eye. Yeah, uh, not ass. Acid. <laughs> <laughs> ass. No, straight out pink eye. No, acid. <laughs> NST. Like it's a tab. I saw him doing. He was just like, it's pretty horrendous to watch. What happened? I don't, I don't think really Did weird. he go to Oxford? University. Oh. <laughs> not not the place. Just like yeah, went to Oxford. Just travel to Oxford. Yeah, just fuck it on LSD. No, he's he's still about. <laughs> well, the same one is distilling hand sanitizer. Just hand sanitizer. I don't know what that is, but this expensive and very accessible product is easy for kids to get their hands on because they all love their soap. <laughs> soap is used to separate the high quantities of alcohol found in hand sanitizer, which is then consumed. The amount of alcohol used by distilling liquor... No, I've read it wrong. Distilling hand sanitizer is equivalent to that shot of hard liquor. 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 <laughs> liquor. <laughs> I'm getting tired. Several cases have been reported that a few teenagers required medical treatment for alcohol poisoning. As a result, parents of Irsha buy the foam type of sanitizer. <laughs> or ones that do not lift their snores as their prime ingredient. Do, do, do you know what this reminds me of? It, Joe, Joe, right. <laughs> right. He, he went, Joe is one of our friends. We have to yeah, yeah, Joe, make it clear. Joe, he, he went, to, when he was in town, I can't remember who he was with. Um, some guy came up to him, opened his coat, and he was like, Do you want some mouthwash? You, know, <laughs> you, 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 you could drink it, uh, and you get really drunk. Like, if you drink a load of mouthwash, you will die. Cause it's got, um, what's it called? Fluoride in it. You will die if you drink a load of mouthwash. So this guy was just trying to sell kids mouthwash. It's ridiculous. Did Joe buy any? No, he didn't. <laughs> oh. But yeah, but, but back to that. Kids are just kids are just stupid. How, how do you even get it out of hand sanitizer? You boil it, doesn't it? Uh, they said you use salt. You use salt, right? But that would just, but that just sounds like shit. It, it sounds like just some parents making some stuff up to scare other parents. It is. Yeah. Whoa, we're getting the foam hand sanitizer. Maybe oh. it's, maybe it's the uh, soap company is trying to like trying <laughs> to get you know just spoil <laughs> the other company. That's true. <laughs> Don't like... use your <laughs> dental. Use our dental. <laughs> your kids no, will be are. dying. Uh, uh, kids will be sober as fuck. <laughs> but yeah, I, I think like I don't get why parents feel the need to scare other parents. So it doesn't make sense. Yeah. No, it's just fear mongering. Isn't it? Yeah, but, it doesn't, but why? How... Why? There's no reason. It's because like oh, we want to feel safe. It's like you're keeping up with the Joneses, but safety wise, isn't it? It's like, yeah, kind, but, like of, it's like kind of like. Um, like, hey, better beware. You know, protect your kids. Kind yeah, of but thing. they go into the length of making stuff up. So it's like, you know. Uh... Well, no, no. It's just like a small minority, like ridiculously small minority. Yeah, well, like a stupid uh, kid from like their class has gone. Hey, I smoked a hand sanitizer or some bullshit like that. Yeah, like, so oh, maybe I ruined just... a pack of Smarties and smoked it. <laughs> like, and then they then they've gone. Oh, if Jimmy's doing it, then my son. Joe yeah, and yeah. blah 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 so, blah yeah, blah. Maybe it's just one person and everyone's Yeah, it's just one person around, in every yeah. country just fucking up all the parents. <laughs> <laughs> they just keep doing that. <laughs> we, oh, can we can we post someone on the parent thing? Just can make one up. <laughs> <laughs> what would yeah. it be? Like kids I don't know. Um Kids are skateboarding while soaking crack <laughs> <laughs> while soaking eyeballs in <laughs> In vodka and taking tampons up the ass. Yeah, yeah. No, uh, uh, well, maybe, yeah, maybe the uh, kids are doing like vodka, vodka. I don't know what's it. Vodka funnel asshole dares. Oh yeah, you know. <laughs> let's, let's do the vodka fountain. You know? <laughs> vodka. Fart, oh, I like it. The vodka, vodka fountain. Blood. <laughs> vodka and blood fountain. First one to pass out loses. Yeah. Or first one to die. But the uh, yeah the eighth one moving on. Yeah, it is car surfing. Oh, I, I, I can guess. <laughs> yeah, it's well. Yeah. Here's how it works: teenagers, <laughs> in case you didn't know, <laughs> teenagers climb on the top of a car, hold on to the roof, and pretend to surf while the driver hits the pedal and drives. The faster right. the car, the greater the fame for the rooftop surfer. <laughs> because you know the next one is Kelly Slater's Kelly Slater's rooftop car surfing on the PS2. Oh right, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, yeah. I said some kids have gone to the extreme and tried surfing on top of trains and subways. The thing is, though, this has been around for a while. Like, um, it's not even that extreme because I mean, there was a guy in Germany called um, the Train Walker, I think his name was, or something like that. But, but I he basically he basically just used to walk on trains, like in Germany, and just like step over and cross over if two trains were coming. Yeah. 
parallel to each other. Which what, is like a, full speed. <laughs> yeah, you just sort of jump like really? switch and turns. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Hell full speed? Fuck me. <laughs> well, say it's like Newton's law. Tear his arms off. No, no, he, he, he'd just jump over. He was on top of the train. He wasn't hanging on. He was just walking on the trains. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> like was, he, he, I think he used to go on the Eurostar. I think, is that right? Yeah, there is. I know there's a train called Eurostar. I don't know, it's pretty fast. Right? I don't know if it goes through Jimmy's at all. But, like, yeah. that's, what, like the, that's what he used to do. I mean, there was, there was videos of him on YouTube or what was before YouTube. So it's obviously been, he's been doing it for a while. So it's just like, why would you bring it up now? Like, you know? Mm, I don't know. No, I don't. Yeah, but it's, it's just, uh, it's just like picking out little things and going like, you know, they're doing this. They could be doing anything. Who gives a shit? <laughs> yeah. Smoking <laughs> weed. Oh no. Oh my god. Dear God. Yeah. Uh, number nine. Coming in at number nine is purple drink. Mm-hmm. Purple drink. No, I've never heard of it. Is it purple? Uh, I hope so. <laughs> I'd be bitterly disappointed when I'm offered some. You know, it's blue, like, no, fuck it. It's not purple. Cousin Purple Drink? Yeah. Um, what is this? It says, this drink has become famous because of various rap artists who drink it in videos. Vap? Did you say rap? Vap? Rap? The, the various vap artists. Vap. <laughs> vap. The, 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 sorry, yeah. Vap a literal drum. <laughs> this is a vapper. Uh, but, yeah. even, <laughs> even NFL players have gotten in on the act. The drink includes a mixture of Sprite, Jolly Ranchers. I don't know what the hell they are. Uh, mm. No, I come from the UK. I don't think we know. So, so, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. What, are they just mixing things up? Um, yeah, they're mixing Sprite, Jolly Ranchers, whatever that is, and uh, codeine cough syrup. Right. <laughs> it is a highly toxic and cause hallucinations, unresponsiveness, and lethar- lethargy. Lethargic. No, yeah. Lethargia. I don't know. No, it. It's lethargia says here, but whatever. Yeah. And I think it's like lethargia. I think yeah, this lethargia. concoction has been glamorized in the music industry so so much so that style of music has even been created to showcase the effects of the drink. Really? No, I've no, I've never fucking heard this. Really? I mean, what bullshit? I think that's, that is bullshit. I've never seen little Wayne, little John getting crunk on some purple drink. <laughs> I've never seen that happen. I don't. I think so. That's bullshit. Yeah, no one goes, "Hey man, let's get the purple drink genre up." Yeah, you'd be like, "Let's go smoke some weed or you know some crack." Let's go get it. some bitches. Not fucking big booty bitches. Purple drink. I mean, they're gonna sound like twats. It's like yo yo, let's get some bitches, some money, and some purple drink, man. Purple drink, yo. Check you check yourself before club, you wreck yourself. Yo. Yeah. This one. Right. It's surprising. Yeah. Although I can see it, I can understand why. This one is chatroulette.com. Oh. oh she's a... Have you been on chatroulette before? Oh, you should have seen this stuff. <laughs> I was on chatroulette. Oh, we were on there before. We were on there before, yeah. Oh, no. It was ages ago. We, were you there when we found Joe on chatroulette? No. <laughs> we were on chatroulette. We were going through it. And then Joe just came up on the screen. We were like, oh my god, it's fucking Joe. <laughs> did he know? Were you, was he like, no, were you we, trying we, to find we, him or did he just, nah, was Joe he was, just wanking off? Oh, he, he, wasn't, he wasn't crying or not. He was just in. For some, he was honestly only in Josh's house for some reason. Just on chat with that. I don't know why I, don't know why I was on chat with that, but right, like we were just there on. Oh, it was really weird. He was just on chat with that. It was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, but, there is some fucked up shit on chat with that. Like, like every two person is just a peanuts. Yeah, I think yeah, I think it's a statistic for every one for every two people on chat with that, one of them is a penis. Yeah, or some really strange thing like a guy shagging a squirrel or something, or a horse. Yeah. Who's got a horse mask on and a bomber mask on? Yeah, 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 that kind of thing. I already said this website allows the user to anonymously chat online. It doesn't. It can see your face. That's not really anonymous. Yeah, it's not really anonymous. (laughs) Almost as not not anonymous. How do you say it? It says without any without any use of security blocks or filters. I actually went on chat roulette like two weeks ago. I think it was just to check it out. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) That sounded odd. Um... (laughs) Yeah, I just went on there and they have blockage now. Like, you can, like, just block people and then they'll send, like, if it, if so many people, like, say, oh, this guy's got his penis out, blah, 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 then it'll go, like, hey, you've been blocked. So, you can't... That, that, that can get... That obviously, you can get around yeah, that, yeah. Obviously, you just change your IP, blah, 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 mm-hmm. whatever. The website's easy to use and does not protect users from out content or disabling images. So, you could just see, like, someone's blue waffle on there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, once you logged on, you actually don't log on because there is no yeah, logging there is, on yeah, system. Yeah, that's true. The site pairs you up with a stranger. The user can choose to skip or go to the next pair and or chat with that individual. So mm. technically, no one really cares. You can just skip them. If you see a penis, just skip it. Yeah, yeah, unless you're into it, you know. 
Yeah, if you enjoy it, just get your penis out then. Yeah, yeah join in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mutual standoff. Give me a dress, you know. Go on, kids. <laughs> <laughs> you can't see that, Carl. Nah, live your own lives. Yeah. No. And then the other one that was big in Florida was bath salts. Uh, yeah, one, I think that's a worldwide thing though. Not yeah. no, no, the US wide. Yeah. Uh, was it China well, as well? Was it China? Uh, no, I think China's just dealing in opium. I think we've been doing that since like the 15th oh, century. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. But like, <laughs> I'm not talking about uh, um, just. I swear, bath house. I don't know because they're eating people's faces and shit, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. That was up like one black guy in Florida. But yeah, it says here, commonly referred to as purple wave and bliss. The drug contains high levels of methadone, melanone, more methalone. MDPV, three drugs that cause hallucinations when smoked, snorted, or injected. And until recently, these sorts were blah 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 blah, smoked shops and sold legally. Uh, yeah, basically the crap that no one really cares mm. about. No one. Well, it's it's like it's like the meow stuff, isn't it? Because uh, they're just selling it to something else. Like they're selling, they used to sell meow as plant. Yeah, fertilizer. plant. Yeah, that's what it was. Well, I mean, you can do it. Like, um, I mean, there was a thing called Jenk or Jenkels, Jenky, something like that. Hmm. It was big in America and it's big in Africa. Right. Basically, you just take like raw sewage water, and then you f- like put a balloon over it or something. You let it go out in the oh, sun. Have you heard about that? You've, yeah. If it, from what I know, it doesn't work. <laughs> so, really? Because um, oh, what is it? Um, you know the guys on Take Sanchez. Uh, what like Pancho? Oh, the, the, Dayton uh, Pritchard. Dayton and I. Is it Pritchard? Not Pritchard. The, the yeah. guy with the blonde hair. Uh, Dan. Is it? Is that a tattoos? Was it Pritchard? Is that his name? I forgot his name. Pritchard and Dayton, the, the two main Probably, ones, yeah. yeah. But they did their own show, going around the world, trying to get all these highs. Yeah. And they did the shit one. <laughs> basically, they left it into the sun, and they just huffed it, and all they did was just stink like shit. <laughs> yeah, basically. So it's it, just like switch, switch, it's just like you're huffing in shit. Yeah, it's just, it's just kids all over the world getting really disappointed. And they're like, oh yeah, we're going to get off in a few days, yeah. you know? Go outside and just huffing shit. <laughs> Maybe that's what they did. Maybe someone just told the kid to do it, and they're like, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> spread around yeah, the world. Yeah, so all the brother that do his younger brother, yeah. and now it's just fucked up the entire world. Yeah, well, that's what the internet is doing to people. Yeah. Well, that's what that's what people believe anything these days, won't they? Yeah, well, it's because there's more idiots, though. There's more people. That's true. There's that more idiots, there's more people. So. Yeah. yeah. Well, that was it, Ree. Well. <laughs> <laughs> that was an exciting adventure with me and Carl. Yeah. Um. Almost half an hour. <laughs> dude, it's fucking too long. <laughs> Um, uh, I don't know if people want to follow us I think we'll put this up on iTunes if we can uh, I'll start an RSS feed uh, our Tumblr 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 should we start a Tumblr Tumblr why not alright what are we called <laughs> <laughs> do you think alright we'll be apodcast.tumblr.com if we can have it maybe someone's already taken it no, let's call ourselves the One Direction here. <laughs> the One Direction podcast <laughs> No, that's not One that. Direction Justin Bieber podcast. Yeah, yeah, let's just do it. Illy Justin Bieber. <laughs> Bieber for Evs, or whatever it is. Belieber, is that what you're the a, one? You're a Belieber, yeah. Is that what and the then you're, yeah. yeah, you're a Belieber or you're a Directioner. I'm a Directioner, yeah. yeah. Right. Anyway. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm an Erectioner. Oh, no. look at you. you I just erect buildings. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and that's all, right? Yeah, so. Uh, um, should we say goodbye? Bye. Bye. Bye, shame. Music by Kevin McLeod of Incompetech.com.